you guys and welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is symphony and today i bring to you my rex to riches ah! okay so when i originally started my channel i always wanted to do rex to riches and make that a legacy for me um and i never got a chance to do that because i never like pushed it out i never continued the series um but i do want to start now so this is my kind of like legacy um let, no I'm, I'm not gonna do it like that okay so this is lauren armstrong she was originally supposed to be my legacy founder in my cottage living series but i didn't execute that out um so I wanted to bring her here today so I kind of got like a little backstory for her or whatnot um but first I want to make a disclaimer I know I have been gone for quite a while I went on a mini vacation um and I was having issues with my game <clears throat> and um yeah because of the patch update so i really didn't get a good chance to come out with any videos um so far with my um save file diaries my roomie's household disappeared i don't know what happened to them but i'm gonna have to start them all over again um that will be off camera and this time i will cheat um the degrees um within the uh safe out diaries instead of pursuing out the whole entire um university discover university thing so i'm gonna just leave that at that um but i will be coming out with a safe out diaries as well but back to regs to riches so this is going to be my rags to riches home chef hustle we have lauren armstrong here um i would say she is about 18 um her backstory is uh she her parents passed away um she used to live on a farm in hinford on bagley with her parents um and they both passed away not at the same time but at different um points and um she was originally left with the farm um trying to upkeep the farm and all of the farm animals she was not able to keep up with the um the payments on the farm um she was noticing that a lot of the bills um were not um i just completely forgot where i left off um so yeah um i'm gonna just go ahead with her backstory again i'm so sorry y'all i had a phone call um out of the blue and um yeah so she was trying to um save her family's farm but unfortunately she was not that good with money and um she ended up losing the farm so she sold whatever she could knowing that the bank took the home um she sold whatever she could to come up with the money to purchase her a home and move to willow creek um so here we are um i'm gonna go over her trade and then I'm going to do the lot traits. And then I want to show you guys her outfits. So let's go ahead. Okay, so Lauren's traits is home chef. Um, she's self-assured. Uh, she would be happy to have a child. Um, she's a hero sim. Um, hero sims are eager to demonstrate the courage to prove their worth and confidence. Subsequently, they might end up appearing arrogant by looking for faults in others to feel good about themselves or pick fights whoa i didn't know that um she's also family oriented um she prefers exclusive romantic relationships um seems to want to be romantically exclusive deal badly with polyamory <laughs> polyamory po polyamory and open relationships of all sorts they need stability and strong commitments in other words full exclusive exclusivity <laughs> y'all please oh my god i have my high school diploma okay <laughs> jealousy may easily catch up 
with them. They dream of finding their one love. Um, she's a domestic sim. It says domestic sims will see their familial relationships grow stronger, faster, and caregiver. Caregiver sims are driven by their empathy and compassion to protect and care. Unfortunately, others can't exploit their good nature for their own ends. Oh. Okay, so it has relationship preferences. Y'all, this is new to me. I've never seen this. Um, I, I have no idea some of this in Create a Sim, but I've never, like, seen this. She has likes and dislikes. Um, she likes the color red white and black um it, it's a lot of other things because <laughs> it's a lot um she likes physical Im intimacy flirtation compliments deep thoughts silly behavior potty humor jokes pranks affection small talk discussing hobbies discussing interests gossip um she likes idealist sims uh romance enthusiasts family motivated sims high energy sims spirited sims nature enthusiasts funny sims optimistic sims hard-working sims and she dislikes ambitious ambitionless sims emotional decision makers um she likes easy listening music backyard music jazz soul world music Singer songwriter music, blues, classical, um, romance, winter, cottage core, and R and B. Um, and then it also has the relationship preferences down here. Um, I've never seen this before until now. Um, she's romantically attracted to men, woohoo with men, um, romantic exploration, no, um, physical romance. Um, excluding woohoo this sim oh it triggers jealousy this sim will have a jealous reaction if they see a romantic partner engage in physical romance with other sims um same with woohoo um this sim will have a jealous reaction if they see romantic okay so it's pretty much the same thing um and that's pretty much it for her trait now i'm gonna go ahead and get into the house you guys i got this house off of the gallery um i do not know who the um creator is for this home but it is beautiful oh my god it is beautiful um it is a lot of work that needs to be done. Um, as you can see, it's overgrown grass. She found this house on Zillow and it was very cheap. And she went through the home buying process or whatever to try to see if she can own her own home, which she did. She was approved. Um, she doesn't have bad credit at all. She just doesn't have any money. Um so yeah um y'all i do not know and i'm sorry if y'all can hear my phone vibrating um yeah that's a bunch of text um i'm gonna try to do the um home tour or whatnot i'm not really good at it like others so bear with me while i do this but this is her front yard this is her side yard that's not gated or whatever this is her porch she got her little mailbox and stuff like that so we're just gonna go ahead and go on in um you guys i am so nervous like i've been trying to create this and here we are okay so she doesn't have any lights turned on so let me go ahead and go down just a little bit so this is the front entrance this is where we came in at um this is kind of like a dining room living room area i don't know it's two areas like this area and this one um but i'm not sure but it's like grungy kind of like a lot of water mold everywhere um, this is her kitchen. It's pretty much a open concept, um, except for this divider here. Her kitchen is big, but it's small at the same time. It's kind of a nice size. Um, it's limited cabinet space, but yeah, we can work with that. It's only us. Um, this is like a hallway area. This is her side door um, that goes to her backyard. Um, as you can see, it's like water mode here. Somebody. I don't know what they did. Um, they didn't 
chip the base baseboard is it called baseboard off all the way down to the brick um yeah this is the hallway um this is the first bedroom um i wouldn't say this is like the master bedroom this is more so like the second bedroom it's fairly small and i was thinking of um just having this as an extra room i don't know um with lauren doing home chef hustle um for this rags to riches um i don't know what she can use that room for um this is the bathroom area um it's kind of all right it's not really much to see so i'm just you know kind of angling the camera around and this door is kind of like a closet but it's pretty much her water heater um, because I do have the um, plum bros in um, this would be considered the master bedroom um, it's very small um, I don't see Lauren staying here long because of how small it is and if I consider her having well if she considers having children um, <laughs> this house might be a little bit too small um, so yeah um this is pretty much the master bedroom it's not that big it's not big it's not as well it's bigger than the other bedroom but it's not as big as a standard um uh, master bedroom would be um but yeah as you can see they didn't bust the walls here and it's water mold coming down all type of stuff okay and then this is the backyard view i didn't want to do it in tab mode um so i got out of tab mode and this is like the backyard view it's a lot of patchy grass everywhere so i was thinking like all of the trash that's everywhere we can get rid of like that'll be easy to get rid of um as far as like the big stuff i think she would have to pay for like you know big furniture to get um taken out um by like um the junk people i don't know um so yeah um she's starting off with zero dollars she i was going to start her off with 50 but i just wanted to make it a little bit harder for myself and have her um go around and like um pretty much find some diggables and you know just just do the all natural you, you know rags to riches challenge okay so she does not have any money to turn on her utilities oh she was already going there girl go ahead then she um does not have any money to um turn on her utilities uh i believe let's see how much it costs i believe her utilities uh, is about 800 okay so home services so for basic it's 329 to set up the cost um for full coverage is 538 and for premium is 890 um for basic we just we only need power water and garbage collection to be honest um even though we don't have a garbage can and then once we get a little bit more money i guess we can keep boosting it up um so whatever you know whatever services we need um right now she doesn't have water she doesn't have lights she doesn't have anything um and garbage will not be picked up um no time soon so yeah so she's already cleaning up and um you know get into what she needs to get to hold on let me see because i don't hear anything you guys might can but i don't hear anything okay so it's nighttime and it's the summer oh my gosh did the lights come on well it is four o'clock in the morning i guess it's from the sun but it definitely looked like the lights came on so you guys can get a good glimpse of it here um i don't know why her garbage can is down like this i have no idea why it's like that okay so what i wanted to do is have her go around willow creek to see if there is something we can like dig up and 
potentially get some type of money to turn our services on. So here go one here. Um, I do want to kind of play with this tree, but I don't know. Um, I do want to have her fish as well. Um, and I don't know about these, uh, maybe we can like figure out like a price to get, um, lawn care services done, probably like 50 bucks to get, um, all of this, um, picked up. So we would have to, whatever she makes, we would have to like, um, take out $50 to have a lawn service come mow the lawn. Okay, so I see a plant here. It's a bluebell, but it's not ready. It should be, oh, here go a garden. Oh my gosh, I do want her to start a garden as well. That way um, we can look for frogs too. That way we can have our own um, fruits and vegetables or we can um, we can harvest bluebells. We don't need them, but it's good to have them so we can sell them. Um, is there any apples? No, it's out of season. Um, let's see. It's probably some somewhere else. Um, what is this? It's not ready. Um, it's something right here too. Snapdragon. Oh, here go another one. Oh, we can look for another frog. Um, when she's done, like picking up all of the diggables then we can go ahead and do a little bit of fishing um try to um here go another one try to have her um you know collect some um money so we can get something started um i'm pretty much starting from scratch this is still my save file um of my save file diaries and also of um made with love as well um i just you know i haven't touched foundry cove in rollo creek so um i wanted to go ahead and start with like adding like different family dynamics into um my save file y'all oh my god she found a heavy metal I am so excited about this. I cannot wait. We also need to look up um, how much the Home Chef Hustle um, table would cost. Um, we do need to get her skill up in, um, let me see, because I don't think she has any skills. No, she has one in gardening. But um, yeah, I would want her to start learning how to cook. So that way she can um, make some good dishes to sell. Huh. Y'all, I cannot wait to see what she got. Okay, so let's find a fishing spot over by our house. It's right here. Oh, here go another um, frog thing. And I'm going to breed the frogs as well. Um, so that way she can continue to earn um, money from, you know, breeding frogs. Mm. Let's see. The next thing I want to do is have her fish. Yeah, we are doing so well. I like this. Hopefully she can find something. It is the summer. Um, we are on day three of 28 in summer. And it's six o'clock in the morning. Hopefully we can catch some type of fish. I don't know. I also want to have her um, 
own this i mean she owns the home but i also want her to rent it if um it comes to that once we move like i can just see the future for her <laughs> so um i was thinking of like her actually owning this lot and renting it out um probably by using the um for rent pack or um the real estate uh mod by sim realist so we have those options oh, Come on, it look like you got something. Oh, she got a log. If she doesn't find anything here, then we're just going to move on to like, um, and it's a bunch of fish in the water. She just doesn't have a good skill with fishing. That's what it is. Um, We'll move to the next area of where she can fish because I think this is just like, uh i don't know is this a river or a stream hopefully she can get something but i don't want this to be repetitive so um nine times out of ten when we have to uh do this over and over again um i will either edit it out or um just make it like a b-roll shot of her just like you know making her a little bit of money to get her home together um she has to do something um i don't see her getting a job she does want to work for herself um but I don't want to make that not an option um, because she doesn't have any skills to do anything. Um, so her getting a job so quickly, I, I just think that unrealistic. I mean, you can always go to like a temp agency, I believe, to get a quick job. But in The Sims, I kind of want to make it a little bit hard for her um, trying to find a job because I can feel where she's coming from um, with trying to get a job to start her own business. I don't know. You guys tell me what you think um, she should do um, because we can get a job to help us earn money to start our Home Chef Hustle business or we can continue the regs to riches way and just keep finding money um by doing like things like this like fishing and um finding diggables and stuff like that um i do need to look up the rules so i can see how it actually is oh my gosh she caught something it says a digital camera uh, Lauren just caught a barely digital camera. Oh, she is hungry. Okay. So what we can do is, hmm. We can. Hmm, let's see. We found a robot salvage part. And this is worth ten dollars. We found a fossil ah. with two fossils. Mm -hmm. Um, and I believe we have to break these to see what we got. We got a heavy metal for 30, and um a barely digital camera for 85. Oh, you guys, I didn't even go over the lot traits for her. So um, the lot traits for her house. So let's do that really quick. So for her house, um, I don't know why this says reduce and recycle. Um, I originally had it something else, but I don't know why um, it did that. Um, but it says reduce and recycle this lot generates combustible and recyclable trash and outdoor cans are no longer bottomless actively managing the trash output is a must um it does have great soil for gardening um i'm not sure if i want her to do 
fruits and vegetables and herbs or do flowers um I really want her to do like the food um so we might do that well we're gonna do that and then it is a cat hangout so stray cats um would pop up every now and again um I'm from Chicago so I see a lot of cats running around everywhere um she does have a bunch of lots uh challenges um there's creepy crawlies it's filthy it's gremlin so a lot of things will break um I don't know if I should have turned on heating and cooling but we'll see um how her moodlets will change um it does get moldy as you've seen the water molds and um she does um have the simple living so we will need to buy ingredients for our food and i'm keeping that in because that's a challenge for me um and then um it does have sims link internet and that's pretty much it Okay, so it says, looks like the fish in this area are too crafty for Lauren. Try fishing elsewhere until she has more skill or try using more valuable bait. And it says, all lifestyles have a limited amount of progress that can be gained daily. Lauren has reached the daily cap for a lifestyle. And that's pretty much it. So I'm going to go ahead and clear out that so I can know what's going on all right so um i did see like a um let's see a little stand over here oh they go bob pancakes um and kyle what's his last name kyle kyleson um so what i'm going to do is see if she can grab her some food um because her latre is um simple living so she's not able to like um purchase anything right now until we get um you know some money so so far we got 22 dollars let's extract this fossil and let's extract this one um oh my god that's 140 dollars um, we're gonna sell this digital camera. We have two forty-seven, y'all. Here is a heavy metal for thirty. Y'all, this is amazing. Okay, so we got frogs. We have a dirt frog, a striped dirt frog, and a super surfer leaf frog so with the dirt frog i think i want to breed it with everything else so we're gonna do that so we got another um dirt frog so we're gonna go ahead and let me see can we okay so we can only breed one frog at a time so we can go ahead and sell this and then every now and again we can go ahead and try to um you know see how often we can breed frogs um so we can get you know a little extra coin um so far we got enough money to get us something so um we have our choice of a hot dog or a hamburger i think she'll go ahead and get a hot dog um so we're gonna have her get that so that way she won't be too hungry and y'all i do have to go through my game and try to like um add some new sims into my game um i was thinking of looking up some kyra's um sims to see if i want to add some of those to my game because a lot of people who do so, do sim dumps Vanessa they have a jam pack with cc and i try not to download all of the cc that they have because it's so much and I want to keep my mods folder um, pretty much clean. I don't want it to be like, you know, really messed up and not know where things should go. Um, and everybody doesn't keep their folder clean. So she's sitting here with Bob um, eating her food. I wonder if she's going to talk to him. That's my whole thing. Um, and he looks like he's angry so and yes she is talking to him oh he got up and walks off <laughs> he 
he got up and walks off. Oh, she's going to take a nap on the bench. Oh, my goodness. I did not know she was tired. I really didn't. I knew she was hungry. Yeah, and I'm so sorry. I'm eating. It's breakfast time for me, so I'm trying to get my food in. Oh, Kyle left. At least we got us a hot dog. Um, what could we do with this 276, you guys? And we got a welcome wagon. Oh my god, one thing I know is we can go ahead. And invite everybody in because she has the super chocolate summer's bomb cupcakes and they're normal quality. And I know Summer likes to cook because she works, you know, at a, um, I think she works at a restaurant, I believe. So we can go ahead and take these cupcakes and yeah, this is also a good way for us to meet friends oh there's eric lewis look it's a cat already here x the noise on they're like hello I appreciate this. Like, I really do. So, um, welcome to my home. I know it's not much. How did this cat get in here? Shuna. Oh, my goodness. Uh, so, cats just randomly come in the house. Oh, my God. That's going to be a serious problem. I don't mind it either, but it's just, oh my God, cats are in our house. So it looks like she's going to talk to Travis. Oh, or Liberty. She's not really talking to anybody. What we can do is put away these cupcakes. And then we have us some free food. Um, excuse me, cat. Let's shoe him. Shoe. To get off our counter. Lauren, please tell him to get off the counter. Yeah, I honestly think my game is still broken. Because I don't know why it's just delayed like this. So let's go ahead and friendly introduce. Ask about their careers. Okay, we're going to get away from the cat. Oh, I couldn't talk to the cat. That's what it was. Okay, let's greet Liberty. I got to give them makeovers, update them. Oh, she walked off to the side to talk to her. Okay, cool. Let's see what kind of sentiments. And we ain't even talked to Summer. Um, We find her immature and she thinks we're responsible. And for Travis, she perceives him as basic looking, but they have amazing compatibility, which is good. Um, let's go ahead and speak to Summer because it seemed like she's being kind of rude in our home. So let's go ahead and greet her. Dag dag. Like, even though our home is trash and we don't have anything, that doesn't mean you can come up to my home and be rude because you can get the fark out um we have amazing compatibility um we find her interesting and she finds us res responsible yeah. 
Moose. Y'all, we are tired. That's what we should see if we can get really quick. Um, I'm going to see if we can get rid of this um trash. So let's go ahead and get rid of this and see if we can get a bed in here and we don't have to get like a full size bed we can get like a twin i mean um yeah a twin bed so so far we have this gordian pot um and then we can also get one of these but what i was thinking is to just get the cot um, because it's, you know, more realistic. Um, I did want to get the air mattress, but I don't think we have enough money for that. Um, where is it? I think it's like the camper stuff. Oh, here it is. The air mattress. Yeah, that's three forty five. So um, we can go ahead and get the cot for now. Um and let's probably change the like colors of it um so they have gray yellow blue red and yellow let's just do yellow i don't know or we can do red we'll we'll just do yellow it doesn't really matter okay so now we only have 21 dollars left <laughs> um so yeah, um I guess each each time we need to do something in a room, we'll just go ahead and um clear out the trash. Um because it is a little bit of trash in here and it's a little bit of trash here, but I don't think she's going to really touch this stuff um just yet. Um, let's actually see i don't think we can get anything yeah because it's no power and she's very tired i do want to change her aspiration um it says quality of life I think I want her aspiration to be quality of life. Oh, Yeah, they might be her friends, like her little friends she can have. Like, can y'all help me clean up or something? Liberty. Bain. Summer, Bobby Travis, Travis. bit about social Bobby. life. Brapna, Mom, Larkin, oh, Lenf. Uh. Oh. Oh. But for some cool. reason, they like that. They like hearing That's juicy drama. Dom Sabuna, Arps. Yeah, they're aga. just talking it up. I'm gonna just let them talk. And look around for some um some more stuff. I'ma probably if I don't see anything else, what I'ma do is I'ma have her um yeah, here goes some diggables. I'ma have her go fishing. Um, because it looks like it's not much. And it's a lot of people out. Like, I like that. Yes, let the neighborhood thrive. See if it's someone behind this house. No. Okay, so yeah, I think I'm gonna go ahead and have her um fish. Um, because I think in the spot she was fishing in, which was right here, it said it wasn't any um fish. So we're gonna go down a little bit and have her go fishing there. <laughs> Oh, what did you get? You dug up a capsule. Oh, she's so tired. Girl, it's only 12 in the afternoon. Well, maybe she can... See, that's the thing. It's a garden here already. So we really don't have to start a garden no time soon, which is good. But the only thing is... 
they're not bloomed yet. Like nothing is here to pick or I can try to see if we can purchase some. Oh gosh. Okay, so it says that we can get some stuff for $25, which is catnip herb, but we don't want that. Everything else is 35 and we only have $21. So we're not going to be able to do that. Um, <laughs> she is exhausted. <laughs> she is really exhausted. <laughs> Oh, but we need the money. We really need the money. At least if we can get... um, We're going to try to see if we can get $300. Just off of, you know, the things around and fishing. Y'all, this cat thing is going to be a serious issue. Because they run right into the house as if, you know... <laughs> This is their domain. Like, I don't like this. Pretty soon, they're going to be scratching up the walls. Just like this cat. I don't know what this cat is doing, but yeah. We got to get rid of these cats. Like, for real. That's, that's going to be a problem. Did you catch anything yet? Yes, we finally caught a fish and we reached level two. So how much is this? This is 15. So we got $36. Hmm. What we can do is see if we can um get enough money to turn on our power and um also we need um to get fifty dollars to get some lawn care started somebody to mow the lawn um and i believe what did it say how much was the power services so we need 329 for our services our power water and garbage to be turned on then we also need fifty dollars to get lawn care so we got a lot going like don't get me wrong i can go ahead and sell these frogs but i also want to breed them as well oh we got another Wait, oh my gosh, we got a dirt surfer. So we bred a dirt frog in a surfer leaf frog, I believe, or something. I don't even know what we <laughs> bred it with. Um, we found a guppy for six dollars. Um I kind of want to keep this frog now to see what I could breed it with. And then I want to open this up. Okay, we're going to fish two more times. And then um, we're going to open up this capsule and then continue on with fishing again. Hopefully by that time, the welcome wagon is gone. Um, because we did enough talking, um, it's time to make some money. Y'all, I do not want her to get too tired. Let's see. She's, she'll become Ooh, exhausted in two hours. So, okay, oh. we're going to continue fishing. Um, but we got another digital camera. Cool. So that's 85 bucks right there. So let's go ahead and um, take out 50. So wait, let me, let me get my calculations together. And see how much we'll have after taking out $50. Because I got my handy dandy calculator right here. So we will have $77 left after taking out $50. So we're going to set it at $77. And then we're going to go ahead and start mowing the lawn. Well, having the lawn mowed. 
Okay, so we have this here. Oh, it cost. Okay, so we can't do it that way because um it actually pays us. Oops, it actually pays us. So let's go ahead and set it back to $77. And then we're just going to like de destroy them. Okay, so I can't believe we have to do this one by one. But it is what it is at this point. <laughs> okay, so the welcome wagon is almost gone. This is a lot. But they're doing a really good job at mowing. They're doing a really good job. Hold on, let me make sure I'm not getting my tree. Yeah, so. Her line is going to look just like everybody else's. Nice and clean. And I'm very excited. I am. Like, it's going to be so much progress made. I believe in the next episode, I'm going to have, like, her actually go out and explore you know willow creek and see what's out there um again this is my main save file so i'm in the process of like um turning it kind of into like chicago a bit um so yeah it's gonna be really fun um i'm trying to look for like libraries to put in my um in willow creek all right so they mowed the lawn and it looks nice it looks very nice um we just have to haul out all of this trash um let's go ahead and check on lauren and see uh what she has done so far um so far she got a perch for 15 which is good she got another capsule thingy Oh, she got a voodoo doll. Wow. Um, let's see. 950 doll hairs. Oh my god, girl. Stop fishing really quick. Okay. This is amazing. This is amazing. Okay, so we're going to um sell that. Um, let's go ahead and have her sleep really quick since everybody is gone. And then, um, we're going to turn on her services. Oh my gosh, you guys, we have 1,507, 500, $1,057. <laughs> okay. So uh, let's go ahead and turn on her basic home services for now um that way her bills won't be so freaking high and then we're gonna auto lights all lights so that way her bill won't be so high okay so she's going to sleep now um and what we're gonna do is let's see this was a hundred uh we can't breed a frog right now so she's asleep. Um, what we can do is check and see like how much this would be to haul out um furniture. Like <laughs> I don't know, like hold on y'all, let me check. Okay, so it says um general debris is 100 to 800 dollars and major appliances yeah. is 60 to 250 dollars so i would say major appliances um let's see Junk removal costs around two forty one on average, and most homeowners pay between three seventy two for services. Okay, let's say for her, it's gonna cost three hundred. Mm, let's say because she only has this dresser. 
that she really needs to get out in these tires. So I would say a reasonable price is $150 for her to get all of this removed. So let's go ahead. Oh, she's taking a bath. Oh my god, I know she is so happy. Um, we also do need to buy groceries as well so she can eat. Um, so let's go ahead and say that you know, this here, we're gonna destroy this, destroy this, destroy, destroy. destroy and we're gonna say that it's about two hundred dollars so we're gonna set her stuff to 528 528 and say that we got that removed and then um we're gonna have her just you know toss this in the dumpster She's going to come out here and toss the rest of this. Let me see. Okay. She's going to toss the rest of this in the dumpster as well. Y'all, we are making progress. Besides all of these key, uh, cats in the line. Oh, my God. Thank you so much for the follow. I really appreciate you. Like, they're just in the house. Like, oh my gosh. Okay, so um, it's some more trash that's also in her house, but I'm not gonna do that until after she gets out of the shower. Y'all, we are making so much progress. I really like this. Um, another thing I do want to breed a dirt frog again with a surfer. Lauren has bred a new frog. So we bred another surfer leaf frog. And we got $10 off of that. Um, Let's have her go ahead and look. These cats are just roaming amongst our home. Oh, this one has, and her name is Cajun. Oh my goodness. Let's speak to Cajun and see if she likes us. Because I can keep her and then shoo these other cats away. Oh, Devine Doyam. Let's see. Okay, we became acquaintances. Let's see. Um, it's a male cat. Why does he have on a dress? Pets often feel strongly about someone, but this pet doesn't seem to feel much of anything. Okay. Um, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe we'll think about it later because right now we really cannot afford a cat right now. So... Another thing I want to do is have like a lot of this molds gone out of the home. Oh my God, it is too many cats just around here, just jumping. Okay, let's, let's shoo, shoo, and you, shoo. Get out. So we can eat our cupcake. Okay, we're going to take out this trash really quick. After we take out some of this trash, um, the cat should be gone by the end. Because I don't know. Somebody probably left a can of tuna out or something. I'm not even sure. Um, So what we did was we paid for our lawn care services for $50. We also turn on our uh, power services and our garbage collection for three twenty nine, and we have five thirty eight left. Okay, look. If I would have known it was gonna be like this, I wouldn't have had these cats up in here. 
um let's go ahead and take out the rest of this trash okay so that should be all of the trash nope is one more right here i hope that's all of the trash um if not then we'll just um take it out um so it's coming along in the first episode i really like this um let's see how much her home chef thing would be we also need a bookshelf as well so that way we can um start reading up like cookbooks oh. and stuff like that so um let's see how much the home chef table would cost Okay, so we go to Home Chef. And go to show all. Okay, so where's the table? It's five eighty five. So we need about five fifty dollars more to get this table which is unfortunate very unfortunate um i do want to see if we can get a cookbook okay so she can get uh let's see y'all it's so much to choose from uh, i actually want to put it in this corner right here she can get the Tina, um, Tiana Sims cookbook, or she can get the stir in the pot, which I love. I really do. It's a shelf. So we can go ahead and get that book. And then we can also, um, hmm. My thing is with the bookshelves, we don't have much room besides in our kitchen to put some books. So what I was thinking is to probably put it in the kitchen. until we can get like a few things so that way we can learn how to cook um we do have to sell some of these books and um get the actual books that we need and want um so all of these books here we can definitely get rid of um, these cats are freaking fighting on my counter. Like, oh my God. She's going to have entertainment. Like, I mean, what else? She's going to have some entertainment. Because I have no idea what these cats are doing while I'm trying to sell these books. So, um, okay. So, that was all of the books. Um oh my gosh we got rid of all of those books and we can't buy any books i forgot i have a my in where i have to order the books i think it's a mod on a computer so what we're gonna do is we're gonna travel oh my god it's one o'clock in the morning luckily the library is open 24 7 so we're gonna travel to the library and purchase us a book a cookbook i mean uh, um she can't travel oh my gosh she cannot travel <laughs> she can't travel um maybe we should upgrade our services one more time 
oh my god that's 208 but i think it's worth it so that way we can travel this better work this better work oh my god yes it works okay so i'm going to have lauren travel to the library yeah i can't wait until i get my world together like it's gonna take some time but i hope you guys are patient enough to stay with me um yeah uh let's see okay so we are here at the willow creek archive library um we're going to go ahead and jump on a computer we don't want the computer right by the door which computer is she finna get on okay i see Aaron. okay good because i just said that we is not finna get on the computer by the door okay so <laughs> what i want her to do is she's studying that no i feel like that's something you shouldn't even acquire Like, I really feel like she shouldn't acquire that because, come on now. But anywho, so we're going to go ahead and order. Mm -hmm. What the heck? We can't order books? Maybe I have to put in the Sims link thing on here. When in hard mode, this challenge provides free public Wi-Fi. When in easy mode, this la let's see if this works. Oh. Ah. <sighs> okay, it works. Ooh, because I was about to say, y'all, my game is completely broken. Okay, so we're going to get a skills book. And, oh, we should get a baking book. And a cooking book. That's 150. So we only got a hundred left. All right. Um, oh. let's go ahead and go back home oh. and start reading some of these books. Because we gotta get it together, Lauren. Y'all, I did not show y'all her outfits. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> I was so eager to play that I did not show you guys her outfit. So we're going to jump into Kaz before we have Lauren read these books. And um, I'm going to show you her outfits. All right, you guys. So I'm going to go ahead and end off the video right here because my game is very much so broken. And I don't know what's going on. Um, every time I try to go into cast to show you guys the outfits that she has, um, it takes a long time to load. Um, so unfortunately, I'm going to go ahead and end it here, um, check on my mods folder, take everything out and put it back in to see if my game, if something is broken or if it's just my game, I don't know. But thank you guys so much for tuning in to my rags to riches home chef hustle edition i really appreciate you and you guys let me know what you guys want to see happen with lauren on her journey to becoming wealthy so i will see you guys in the next one bye guys